Charlemagne say the gang dunk it of the Charlemagne. You are a donkey. <laughs> it's time for donkey of the day. Donkey of the day does not discriminate. I might not have the song of the day, but I got the donkey that. So if you ever feel I need to be a donkey <laughs> man, hit me with the heat. The Breakfast Club. Yes, donkey of the day for Tuesday, September 19th goes to Chanel West Coast. You know Chanel West Coast and I had a little encounter earlier this year on MTV's Ridiculousness. Let's hear it in case you're not familiar. Yeah, like my only strategy is just to tell the truth. It's like whatever I said about you, I'm going to say to you. And I'm going to continue to say it to you regardless of how mad you, you get. But just you say something doesn't make it the truth. That's true. It's just my opinion. She's just saying that because I said her, I told her she was whack rapping one time. Yeah. That's all. <laughs> so, have y'all ever heard her rap? Yeah. Oh, okay. Good for the people that said no. Well, oh. no. Oh. <laughs> Hold on. Let's just get to <laughs> Lil Wayne, who co-signed Drake and Nicki Minaj, is the same person who co-signed me. I've won a BET award with Young Money. I got songs with French Montana, YG, Ty Dolla Sign, Snoop Dogg. Mind you, I did a song after getting into a verbal argument with him because he respected me so much after I spoke my mind to him, he still came back and did a song Why with me. Why are you talking with your hands, though? You don't know my musical track record, bro. You I don't, don't know my musical track language. record. Sorry. Okay. I can't be so funny today because he doesn't know my mother musical track record, so get familiar. Chanel is hilarious. Bless her little heart. The thing about Chanel West Coast is that she's always talking about this imaginary resume she has. She's always talking about this track record. She's like the side chick who claims she's the main chick, but when you ask the guys about it that she claims to be with, they don't claim her like that. Now, last night on Love & Hip Hop Hollywood, Chanel West Coast was trying to convince a producer named A1 to do something that no producer really wants to do, and that's record music with her. Last night, Chanel West Coast asked the producer A1 about helping her make some mayonnaise music. Yes, Chanel wanted to know if A1 is interested in helping her provide a soundtrack for her unseasoned chicken breast. And A1 had to remind her that back in the day when I wanted to work with you, you played me. Oh, yes, we've heard this tale before. Back then, you didn't want me. Now I'm hot, they all on me. That's what happened with Chanel and A1 last night on Love & Hip Hop Hollywood. Can we hear a bit of this, please? I rap and sing, and I really like your beats, so we should definitely link up. And just so you can get familiar, like, I was with Lil Wayne and Young Money. Like, I sat and played all my music for Lil Wayne, and I have songs with French Montana, Snoop, be real, Ty Dolla Sign, the list goes on. Oh, you know, my, I got a lot of my collab. brothers. Yeah, you could ask them. I met you before. Um, I wasn't as hot. I was in a session with French Montana. You know, I'm like, yo, we should work. And um, you had your shades on. I don't know. You probably never looked at me, but I was trying to work with you. And um, <laughs> you played me. You know, I hope the best for you. I can't work with you. <laughs> Drop one of Clues Bomb for A1, damn it. Served, right? <laughs> Served tough. That's why you got to treat everyone with respect, because you never know who's going to be who, okay? Basically, A1 told the deli owner to hold the mayonnaise. Now, when the mayo that is Chanel West Coast wasn't allowed on A1 sandwich, when she got introduced to a tribe called Curve, not only did she start running down her track record, it was interesting to see how she took me telling her that she was whack. I don't know if you don't, like, if you know my track record. <laughs> Charlemagne said it, right? Uh, no, I, I had to tell him what it was. Charlemagne also has went at some of the biggest rappers in history, so in my opinion, I'm up, I'm up there with Kanye and Drake and everybody else. Whoa. Whoa. You know what I'm saying? Whoa. Easy, want, easy. But listen, hey, if hey. Charlemagne's been dissing Chanel West Coast, you're just putting me up in the caliber of the mother you dissing. Wow. That's very ambitious. Chanel, That's dope. Chanel West Coast thinks because I have called out Drake and Kanye before that since I called her whack as well, she's on their level. First of all, even though Drake has never been my cup of green tea, I have always said he was an extremely talented individual. Just because I call Kanye West Kanye Kardashian and I think he's in the sunken place does not mean I am not a fan. Kanye West is a musical legend. You, Chanel, are none of these things. All right, let's be clear on that. There are four types of delusions, delusions in this world, all right? You got bizarre delusions, non-bizarre delusions, uh, mood congruent delusions, mood neutral delusions. I would say, Chanel, you fall under the bizarre delusions category. Somebody asked me what bizarre delusions are. Nobody's going to ask me. What's, What's bizarre, bizarre delusions? delusions? Bizarre delusions are considered <laughs> extremely odd, uh, highly implausible, and inappropriate based on the person's culture and life experiences. Okay, an example of a bizarre, a bizarre delusion would be the belief that an alien performed surgery and replaced all your blood with Kool-Aid without leaving a scar. That would okay. be dope. That would Are be dope. Chanel West Coast thinking she's on the same level as Drake and Kanye West because Charlemagne has so-called dissed all of them? I have, been, I have been very specific about any reason why I wasn't feeling Drake and Kanye about something, but those guys are extremely talented. 
Just like with you, Chanel, I think you're a lovely person, but you're just a whack artist. Okay, I think Donald Trump is whack, and I've said that he's whack a bunch of times on this radio, but that don't make you the president, does it, Chanel? Doesn't make you one of the highest politicians in the world, does it? Just because I diss you and Donald Trump. Chanel, you're a whack rapper, okay? You have done music with all of those people. You got this long track record, and it's gotten you absolutely nowhere. You have every musical cheat code known to man, and you keep failing. And you know what they say, when all else fails, there's always delusion. Chanel, don't go chasing Texas Pete. Stick to the Hellman's and the Miracle Whip that you're used to, please. Mm -mm -mm. Give Chanel West Coast the biggest hee-haw. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. I'm actually going to play her joint in the mix this morning. No, you're not. Cause you okay. don't even know, you Why don't, are you, you lying? You, you couldn't name a Chanel West Coast record. Exactly.